The primary reason that we use AWS is definitely all about scalability. We chose it initially because we knew we were going to grow and we were going to grow very rapidly. We looked around a little bit, but for what we wanted to do, it was the only option in, in our minds. I'm Chris Evans and I'm the CTO of FlyPay. We were looking to do something to allow you to pay your bill at restaurant tables and it's quite quickly grown to be a lot more than that. You can order takeaway directly through our app, you can pay your bill at restaurant tables, but we also now build apps for restaurants with our technology inside it as well. We started off with the customer in mind, so everything that we do is all about the customer first. So when we first went into this, we were like, how can you just make payment, which is the most frustrating bit in the restaurant experience, into the most seamless and smooth process as possible. And most people work the other way, they build the functionality that you need first, where we actually go, how can you just make it everything around the customer? And that's what FlyPay is really all about. AWS, what it did for us in terms of business opportunities was with Gourmet Burger Kitchen. They wouldn't have even considered us before, so when we were bidding for the work, one of the key bits when they looked at us was could we actually handle their capacity? So what we've started doing, for GBK for instance, they had an existing app and we've taken their infrastructure that was already there and we've plugged that straight into our infrastructure and then built that as a separate layer to allow us to sort of manage that process. And we were able to take over their app within sort of a six week process, which was crazy to be able to do it that quickly. Like they'd never seen anything like it. And we had no downtime either, which was really nice. We've built the infrastructure on Elastic Beanstalk and we had an RDS database instance. So now we have EC2 instances, so we have 23 was the count today, um, which hosts our backend. So the architecture of our system is kind of based on a number of bits. So we have a number of apps that we power. Uh, we have an API that we've written, and the, the API sits on a number of EC2 servers, which are all load balanced. That sort of powers, I guess, our main part. And then we have the RDS database that those EC2 instances talk to, to be able to store customer data, but then also retrieve it really quickly. Uh, our overall a AWS experience has been great. It's been really easy to get in touch with people. So whenever we do, we just upgrade our support to the top level. We either make a phone call or get on chat straight away, and we're able to get things resolved quite quickly. And it's usually the types of questions where we're not sure what to do, and so we just instantly go to that next level, and it's like having a bit of an extra team in the office, really, which is quite nice. What I really like working with AWS is that I don't have to think about it. It's just something that runs in the background. We don't have to worry about it.